Philo Reactium? Tell me, you ignorant slut. What are you talking about? Ooh, a stash. Go home. I'm not home. I'm next door. Ooh, tuxedo. Oh, that's supposed to be Halo Reaction. I see. I know you're impaired right now. Uh, it was good. Yep, I enjoyed the episode. It was the... It uh, scratched the itch. You know, it was the, the what I was looking for. Um, I think they... They set up enough story and the, the payoff was good. So going forward, I you know I, I don't think I ever didn't trust them. I look forward to more action, more, more storytelling, like all of the above. Like I just look forward to watching that show. I think it's pretty solid. <clears throat> I can't I can't think of like any qualms that I have with that episode. To be honest. Um. Even the Quan stuff, like, I was okay. She got annoying when she was, like, throwing a tantrum. Maybe that's it. Like, I, I thought her, her tantrum was a little annoying. But, I mean, if I was stuck in a desert like that, too, I'd probably be... I don't know if I'd waste my energy that way, but... Eh, it's, it, 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 that's nothing. <laughs> yeah, I, I like that. I'm, I'm excited to see where it goes. I will say, if they uh, if they get rid of frickin' Soren, they won't. Um, yeah, the Quan is... Woo, gonna be a hard sell, but no, I, I thought it was great. I love the grunts, I love the jackals, I love the Johanna, uh, the brutes. So I thought the CGI was phenomenal. Like, I haven't seen bad CGI s s in a while, right? I think episode one is the only one that I could harp on for the CGI, but I thought all of the aliens look great. I think it's interesting what Maquis is doing. Um, I also think the Covenant, so maybe this is another nitpick, I think the Covenant ship should have hit. Maki's drop portal or her drop pod, whatever, and have her like go flying out of it so she's actually bruised up. Because <laughs> it just, like, with the pinpoint accuracy that the Covenant have, I don't know. It, it's a nitpick, like I said. But yeah, it, it was a solid episode. Can't wait for next week. I honestly am trying to think of like, I, I, I've watched it four times. Um,. One by myself. Well, twice by myself. The first time, obviously, the first viewing. The second time was for, like, trying to catch things and analyze things. And my goodness, there is such good detail. If you actually, like, stop and pause and, like, when it switches to the first person view and you see the HUD, like, it has all the Spartan numbers on the side. And when Kai is down, like, it shows her box is red. Well, it shows it orange. So all of them are, like, hollowed out. Except for when she gets injured, it turns, like, solid orange. And then when she's passed out, incapacitated, it's solid red. I love that. The the current software that their armor is running on is 3.43, which I thought, oh, yeah, that's a fun little nod Easter egg there. Um, yeah, yeah, I, I, I liked it. That'd be sus too long after losing a while, ass scout, scout ship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I just, the Maki thing, I, we'll see where it goes. Um, battle was cool. Oop. <clears throat> of course the battle battle was cool. You know what I mean? There's one thing this show has proved. That any kind of like fighting action scene is 10 out of 10 stellar. So I don't know why people are so so stupid. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like why? why it's, it's in episode one. It's legit like 10 minutes in you get this badass fighting scene. I guess they're just... I think you said this. They're not used to, like, waiting week to week for, for things to... For events to unfurl. Like, you need backstory. Maybe you don't need as much backstory as they did. Maybe they could have, like, edited it a little bit better. So that it went a little faster. But honestly, for me, it wasn't that drawn out. Definitely my biggest issue is with Quan and her storyline. Other than that, like... That's what I would say. If, if for anything, just shorten... Shorten Quan's storyline. Done. <laughs> it's pretty solid. I'm excited to see. I I I, I, I am nervous for for Maki. I hope she doesn't assassinate a Spartan because I don't want any of the Spartans to go away. Like I was honestly like 
oh crap, are they gonna kill Kai? Like, is Kai done? And that's what's gonna make Chief like, okay, I understand the importance of the pellet. I see how like the mission needs to be changed and altered. My human instincts mixed with the Spartan knowledge and uh, training that I have now will combine them to create like the Super Soldier Master Chief. That's what I thought they were gonna go with. I mean, we don't know if Kai's alive. I'm hoping she is. I'm sure she is, but she could be dead, right? Like or fatally wounded. Yeah, yeah. This is, is kind of like my take. Uh, I'd be happy to answer questions if you had any questions. But um, it's a good show. It's fun. I like Halo, and I like the Halo TV show. He over here now? Like I swear, I just heard him come from here. I'm very sympathetic for Kai. She's a standout. Yeah, Kai's she's a great soldier. Not soldier character is what I meant to say. There's a lot of great characters, and after like her interaction with uh, Fennec, um, I, I'm convinced that if he were to remove his pellet, he would still be the same. You know what I mean? <laughs> I. I I don't think he'd be much different. I don't know if he can break down. I think it turns into cloth, but yeah, whatever. Break everything down if there's one thing I've learned. From maps to... Yeah, I know. I know how to use the map. Uh, 300. Nice. This backpack is saving my caboose. I think she gets creepy doctor assistant, but yeah, please don't kill Spark. Oh, I hope. I hope Maki kills him. I was hoping... Uh, here's another nitpick that is that's kind of dumb. If that blast when they open or when the the laser cracks open the the uh, what do they call it? The second object, right? The one that they're trying to get off of her in this. If that thing is strong enough, that that sound blast is strong enough to break metal. That dude should have been ripped in half, and anyone around the, the breaking crystal should have been ripped in half. That's uh, <clears throat> that's a lot of that's a lot of firepower, but eh, whatever. Hopefully they're saving his death to like pay off really well. Then I'll I'll forgive it. Cause yeah, that dude needs to like either like get squished. Maybe he'll get eaten by the flood. Yeah, space magic. Yeah, so that's some pretty strong space magic. Oh, is it Fallout Four where there's a thing on this roof? Oh. I hear you. Where are you, you bug? Must be inside. I swear it's Fallout 4 where there's like a, a bag left on the roof. Maybe it's not this roof. Maybe it's a different one. This one looks too, like, well placed. Yeah, yeah, here's that cellar. Oh, wait, no, it's just a power cable. <laughs> Don't think I can pick this. <laughs> this is the hard part about making a character that's based off of luck instead of... Uh... Intelligence, I have no way to get into these safes or terminals. Oh well, I've never played a luck character, so yeah, here we go. Keep it keep it fresh for me. Jeez, it's giving me so many stim packs. I wonder if that's a mod I have on. Or if it's just because I have it on very hard. I don't have it on survival. Because I like fast travel. I don't want to walk everywhere in this game. It's kind of a big game. Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting a ton of healing items, which I'm not going to complain about, but just odd. Different. How do I get out? Uh... Oh. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, I'm glad. Oh, you touched on this too. I'm glad they finally like humanized Halsey and made her not a completely just villain character. Like she when she went out to uh, save Miranda, I was like, okay, I got I got a little like I wouldn't say touched, but like you know a little bit of goosebumps.